in our uh, work, we would like to present uh, what we have achieved in implementing the RPL protocol in INET. Uh, first of all, some um, brief introduction on, um, on the RPL itself. Um, it's also one of the um, most common and uh, I would say standardized uh, distance vector uh, routing protocols uh, that is used in uh, uh, low power and low C networks. Um, it's quite useful for uh, um, wireless um, sensor networks and uh, it supports um, great uh, scalability features, uh, energy efficiency and uh, well, uh, it's also designed to um, enable routing in uh, unstable and um, unreliable networks. This, uh, in this picture, you see uh, the typical um, IATF uh, designed like uh, stack uh, to be used uh, where RPL would be used. Um, it is usually managing, uh, it, it is uh, an IPv6 based routing protocol uh, and uh, it works well with um, other um, well, with other sub layers enabling uh, IPv6 addressing in uh, uh, low power and loss networks, such as uh, six low pan adaptation layer and uh, six stop layer, as well as uh, Tish Mac. Um, uh, some of the main features include, uh, as I've mentioned, scalability, several uh, communication mode support, uh, as well as a configurable objective function module um, to to, to, to suit any uh, kind of deployment or application requirements. Uh, there are also um, different uh, modes, storing and non-storing, to account for different memory constraints on devices, uh, as well as uh, adopted trickle timer mechanism that allows uh, to uh, flexibly uh, leverage um, like network uh, or topology reactivity uh, for uh, energy efficiency. Uh, there are also mechanisms for uh, loop detection and repair, but the protocol itself does not guarantee uh, loop-free topology. As for example, uh, AIGRP. Um, the common um, terminology used in the RP, uh, all throughout the RPL um, documentation is the notion of DODEC, that is a destination-oriented directed as a cyclic graph. Essentially, uh, all nodes um, are forwarding, the, uh, all nodes are assumed to be some kind of uh, sensors which forward the uh, data to the sync node. There are two traffic flows, upwards and downwards, and in the uh, yellow boxes you see the uh, so-called rank of the node, that is its relative distance uh, to the sync, that defines its position in the topology hierarchy. The objective function module uh, accounts for preferred parent uh, selection process, that is uh, what uh, node uh, is chosen uh, to forward uh, node's own data to the preferred parent. Uh, different kind of metrics can be chosen for uh, during this uh, like uh, preferred parent um, evaluation procedure, such as uh, energy, hop count, latency, or any other. Uh, the three uh, control messages only used by uh, RPL are DIO, DAO, and DIS messages. We will only focus on the first two because they are used for uh, topology construction and for downward uh, routing management uh, correspondingly. Um, the uh, modes of operation that I already mentioned are um, uh, define whether, uh, whether uh, each node uh, stores um, a routing table of its sub or on or if only the route has uh, the complete uh, topology overview in case of uh, non-storing mode. Uh, here are the typical examples of uh, multi-point-to-point or point-to-point uh, -point traffic flows that um, may be used in um, RPL-enabled network. Uh, essentially, the data is forwarded upwards to the sink, or in point-to-point -point scenario, uh, it may be also uh, transported downwards, but uh, for that we need uh, a shared or a common ancestor node that uh, has the routing information to downward uh, packet. The trickle timer module uh, uh, is uh, ensuring that in stable network, the messaging frequency is reduced by um, uh, increasing the uh, transmission interval, interval time um, by a factor of two each time the current interval ends, so that um, if, uh, if no uh, inconsistencies happen, uh, the intervals keep growing until they uh, reach their max value and essentially uh, this results in 
uh, and raw messages being transmitted very uh, rarely uh, in the late stages of the network uh, lifetime. Um, our implementation uh, uh, is, uh, well, I, I will go into more detail about the implementation itself uh, in the following chapter. Um, the um, implemented uh, module, so to say, um, acts uh, on top of um, IPv6 and ICMP uh, uh, layers. Uh, the um, RPL class itself um, inherits from or um, extends uh, the uh, routing protocol base um, uh, from INET um, API. Uh, it also makes use of uh, listener and hook based classes to uh, enable uh, processing of um, intercepting and processing packets from uh, lower layers uh, when it's needed for um, uh, loop detection, for example. Uh, then it also uses the uh, trickle timer and objective function modules, uh, the, like the purpose of which uh, I described earlier, uh, which are themselves, the trickle timer and objective function are just a uh, C, uh, simple module and an object um, correspondingly. The RPL, the, um, RPL module is um, used as an internal, um, like uh, there is a, a, an additional uh, router class um, or uh, router module called RPL router uh, created that uh, has this uh, embedded RPL functionality and itself extends the um, ad hoc host uh, module uh, that is uh, commonly used for uh, also other uh, MANET uh, routing protocols uh, in INET, implemented in INET. Uh, this is a more uh, detailed overview of how um, uh, currently um, this RPL uh, class is um, interacting with um, other INET um, layers. Uh, it's currently using the uh, Ecking wireless interface uh, and unit disk radio medium uh, as a, a layer two and layer one. Um, technologies correspondingly, and um, it has also been uh, tested uh, with uh, UDP and ping apps, um, and uh, uh, like this, these are certainly like verified um, compatible, but um, we expect also any other uh, upper or lower layers protocols to be uh, compatible with the proposed um, RPL uh, module. Uh, the implemented features um, can be listed as follows. Uh, the two main control messages are implemented, uh, that is uh, the IO and the AO uh, that are required for uh, topology construction and uh, downward routes maintenance correspondingly, uh, both mode of operations, mo mode of operations, as well as uh, all of traffic flows except for peer-to-peer um, -peer, uh, traffic in storing mode, which requires uh, the source routing uh, header construction by route and uh, is a work in progress currently. Uh, also, some of the extra features include uh, poisoning mechanism, which I'll explain a bit later, and the loop detection uh, mechanisms um, as well. Um, these are some of the uh, parameters that um, are configurable via uh, any file uh, for, the, for this R RPL module. For example, the uh, storing, um, storing or non-storing mode, uh, the root capabilities, uh, poisoning um, features, as well as, uh, for example, DAO messages that may be disabled to uh, disable download routing if it's not needed. Uh, next, uh, I'll um, demonstrate some of the show, of the prepared showcases, uh, exemplifying various features and um, like um, minimal working examples that can be used with um, with this RPL implementation. And we'll start with the most basic, uh, uh, like um, topology construction uh, process. Uh, the uh, for for all uh, showcases show next, uh, the following uh, network uh, is considered consisting of uh, six no uh, yeah, consisting of six, six nodes, uh, five um, kind of sensors or uh, hosts, and one uh, sink. Um, the uh, uh, simulation parameters are more or less um, as follows. Uh, the common payload uh, of 56 bytes is used. Uh, the uh, All nodes transmit uh, their data packets with an uh, interval uh, drawn from, uni from uniform uh, distribution. And the distances between uh, neighbors are somewhat like uh, 120 meters. 
while the uh, communication range is 150, so that basically each node has only uh, two uh, neighbors or three if it's near the sink. Um, yes, the um, topology construction process happens when uh, sync starts uh, broadcasting DIO messages and nodes, um, RPL routers enabled uh, with um, RPL functionality uh, will process these uh, DIO packets and join the proposed uh, door deck. Uh, here's a, sim uh, a small uh, 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 animation uh, showing the, uh, this process just briefly. Uh, so generally, uh, he, he, here it is fast forwarded to 10th uh, second already. Uh, at first, we can see that um, at fourth, um, well, I mean, at, at first, uh, the nodes that are nearest to the thing, uh, to the sink, are joining the um, RPL, uh, the the, uh, the door deck. Uh, I'm sorry for lack of uh, proper visualization here. Um, the um, in in this. Um, uh, moment uh, host one, uh, one second, host one uh, has joined the newly advertised uh, door deck. It updates its uh, can, uh, its preferred uh, parent, uh, sets it to the sync uh, with the uh, IPv6 address ending in uh, one. It computes its uh, rank as well. Uh, here it sets its rank uh, to two and uh, it basically starts broadcasting the DIO messages uh, itself further. Also, because in this case, DAO functionality is enabled, uh, host one upon joining a DODAC also introduces uh, its presence to the sync by sending a DAO message. And basically this process uh, happens uh, hierarchically further or uh, sequentially um, and all nodes uh, are joining the door deck with the um, with preferred parent uh, with corresponding preferred parent, basically. Um, the uh, multi-point to point uh, traffic um, is the type of uh, traffic flow that was used in this uh, topology construction example, where uh, each node basically sends uh, UDP packets to the sync uh, using the uh, constructed RPL topology and by forwarding message uh, to its preferred parent and uh, like in upwards direction. Uh, next scenario is the um, dynamic one where uh, some mobility is introduced. Uh, host 2 uh, moves away from the sink's reachability and loses the connection to it, causing the following uh, routing loop. Uh, essentially, uh, host 2 clears its uh, DODEC or uh, RPL state and rejoins node 4, um, creating uh, this kind of uh, loop, which uh, can be resolved using the uh, poisoning uh, functionality or poisoning mechanism uh, as follows. Uh, upon uh, losing connection to the sink, uh, node 2 clears uh, its uh, RPL state or um, DODEC state and should uh, broadcast, if poisoning is enabled, should broadcast a special DIO advertising an infinite rank uh, to enable its former, ch former children to erase it from their preferred uh, parent sets and uh, for these children to rejoin the dodec using, for example, backup parents, as for example, in this case, node 4 can use node 3 uh, to keep connection to the same dodec, uh, but uh, set the preferred parent, uh, but update the preferred parent. Um, th uh, then, uh, as a last step, for example, if node 2 has stopped um, moving, for example, but it still uh, retains some uh, connectivity to node 4, it's after, po after poisoning uh, node 4 and enabling node 4 to join the same dodec via node 3, node 4 starts uh, rebroadcasting DIOs itself and allows node 2 to rejoin the dodec as well, uh, but without any loops. Um, these are the examples of the typical point to multi point traffic, uh, which can occur either uh, hop by hop, um, by, by using hop by hop routing uh, in storing mode, or uh, by uh, using a source rooted header 
uh, in non-story mode, where uh, Sync has explicitly tell on each hop where to forward the packet. Uh, the point-to-point -point traffic works uh, quite in a similar ma manner, uh, or is implemented is quite in a similar ma manner as uh, point multi-point traffic, and also requires, as I already mentioned, some common ancestor to forward the packet uh, downwards. Uh, here is also a small, uh, well, maybe not so uh, short, um, example of a um, loop detection mechanism uh, that is present uh, in this implementation. Uh, in this particular example, uh, we are talking about rank error. Uh, I will explain briefly and show uh, what it means. Essentially, uh, when host 2 uh, uh, loses the connection to the sync, uh, it uh, rejoins, um, as I've shown previously, it rejoins the dodec. Um, using the host for, and this uh, kind of uh, looping route uh, is formed. So here we are seeing that uh, host2 has lost um, connection uh, to the dodec, and uh, it will be, um, yeah, it, it clears uh, the its routing state and will rejoin uh, the dodec through uh, host4, but without any uh, poisoning. Yeah, so uh, sometime later it uh, rejoins host 4. And um, what would happen next is that, uh, for example, at some point, uh, the, the host 5, that is uh, a bit uh, lower than host 4 here in the picture, it's not uh, observable, but uh, for example, some node uh, may uh, try to forward uh, data packets uh, through, through host 4, and then uh, the uh, the um, rank error uh, will uh, occur where host 4 and host 2 will basically bounce the packet to each other because they would think that uh, they are each other's uh, or they would have each other as their preferred parent. Um, to shorten this uh, this animation, I would just directly jump uh, to the explanation of um, how this rank error happens and how it is resolved. Essentially here, uh, what I meant, the uh, data packet is being uh, transmitted from host 5 uh, host 4 uh, tries to forward the packet uh, to its supposedly preferred parent, host 2. Uh, host 2 determines that uh, the packet uh, comes uh, kind of upwards, but from a node with a lower rank, which shouldn't be possible. Uh, and it returns, uh, the host 2 returns the packet to node 4 with a rank error flag set to 1. Uh, this is not yet the rank error, uh, like um, uh, not, not a condition for a loop, dete loop detection uh, trigger, because this rank error should happen twice. Uh, therefore, um, host4 uh, rechecks, uh, rechecks that this data packet is coming from a node with higher rank, and uh, the rank error check passes. The, the packet is bounced back again at node 2, and then uh, the repeated rank error is detected and uh, the DODAC re repair procedure would be issued. Uh, one last um, uh, loop, uh, loop, loop um, routing loop example is the forwarding error, uh, which is much simpler to, um, well, uh, to showcase. Uh, it, is, it means essentially that, uh, for example, when host 2 has uh, moved away from the sync for some time, and then if we assume that it returns back, but uh, it has its uh, previously stored routing state and uh, RPL state cleared, uh, it may happen that sync um, may want to forward uh, the packet downwards uh, through node 2. So yeah, uh, here you see that uh, host 2 has uh, cleared its um, uh, routing table but then it returns back into sync's vicinity. And at some point, sync may try to forward some data to host 5, for example, uh, but host 2 uh, has, uh, hasn't got uh, that uh, routing information anymore. So uh, the uh, forwarding error is reported back to the sync uh, to clear uh, the, this erroneous um, state. Um, now we come to the conclusions. Essentially, what we have achieved currently is the implementation of core RPL functionality uh, as per um, RFC 6550. 
as far as um, the um, design idea was, it retains some kind of modular structure in terms that uh, the trickle timer and uh, objective function are completely, um, well, uh, they, they can be, uh, the, the implementation uh, can be um, exchanged or extended by other modules or exchange completely. Um, also, we have these several uh, showcase scenarios uh, prepared and uh, already available um, in the ini file with corresponding configuration names, as well as uh, some unit tests. And for the future work, uh, we see a promising direction is the uh, integration of uh, RPL with a 60 uh, stack that is uh, using this um, ITF defined uh, six low pan, six stop, and um, dish um, layers uh, to uh, to have the the, the complete uh, stack uh, implemented. And also, uh, of course, the uh, features, uh, not, not yet all uh, relevant features are implemented from RFC. And also, it would also be nice, of course, to have the um, continuous integration setup and uh, the automatic test coverage uh, configured uh, as per uh, common uh, software development cycle, so to say. Uh, here are some of the references that were uh, used uh, in the presentation. Um, and also the, um, the, uh, all of the shown um, uh, examples were tested with um, INET 4.2 and uh, OMNET versions 5.6.1 and also the compatibility verified with uh, 6.0 preview 8. Thank you for your attention. And